Hey, hey everybody. Today's going to be kind of a different uh, video. What do concert photographers and Dollar Tree haul shoppers on YouTube have in common? That's what I'm going to explain to you right now. I'm Robert Maxfield and I'm a concert photographer in Dallas, Fort Worth, Texas. I've been doing this pretty close to 50 years and I've shot all kinds of bands everywhere. But um, there's some things that you do as a concert photographer that a lot of things people don't see in the background and one of those things is producing your your petty shopping list your your small items and uh, ordering those getting those things in before you do a concert so uh, that's what I'm going to go over today so I'm going to give you a little bit of a taste of that in just a second About once every uh, three to six months, depending on how busy things are, we put out a shopping list of supplies that we need. And normally, uh, a large part of that is ordered from uh, B&H in New York City. So B&H gives uh, us excellent service. They give us uh, normally two-day shipping. This time it turned into six because of FedEx, unfortunately. But we got everything that we ordered. It all came in one shot. And uh, so I'm going to go over some of the things that we got that are in that list. Uh, the first thing we got, so Julie can do her her YouTube channel and uh, some other stuff for me. Um, this is what it kind of looks like, but we got a uh, a new Seagate two terabyte um, hard drive. It's a portable hard drive, USB three, plugs into her, her new uh, her new laptop, so she can take down the video and edit it and then give it back to me and then we put it up on YouTube so it's an essential part of what we do uh, another thing that we got I got this for Christmas this is a, a Kamica CVM uh, what do they call it it's a CVM VM 10 uh, mark 2 um, microphone and it's a nice microphone because the one we used to use and we're, I'm using today is a Nikon uh, ME1 and um, this is a lot better microphone. It's a lot more uh, directional. But the other thing too, it's inexpensive. I think this is like somewhere in the neighborhood of like twenty-nine dollars, thirty, thirty-two dollars online. It's basically a Rode clone, but it has one fatal flaw: the hot shoe or the cold shoe uh, apparatus that it slides into um, disintegrated. So you go, oops, okay, that's a problem. So how are you going to mount your um, how are you going to mount your microphone anymore with the base of it broken off? Well, it has a one quarter by twenty screw, which is the same kind of screw that you would mount into a tripod. There's a company called Cambate that you can order an adapter. It runs four ninety five, and you can order it and screw it into the bottom of it, and that basically repairs it. It's a uh, kind of it's metal instead of being plastic. I think or yeah it's a heavy kind of like an aluminum but that saves you from having to buy another $32 microphone um, and normally I, I ordered a couple of these Cambate um, adapters at five bucks a piece shoot yeah because the mic is really really pretty nice so along with that we ordered a new um, what they call the Kamica V30 light microphone we haven't tried it out yet we're gonna try it out in uh, in some uh, light concert um, video uh, jobs it's got a good rating it I got it for thirty two dollars can't beat that we're gonna try it and see what happens if not I'm, I'm not out a whole great amount of money so those two microphone things are what we got um, from them so uh, oh, I also want to mention that uh, as soon as uh, B&H, I ordered the, the hard drive from B&H, they had it on sale for $80 for a 2 terabyte portable, which is pretty good, USB 3. And uh, the next week I looked at it, and, or the next day I looked at it, and it was on sale for $69. So I called them up and said, hey guys, and they said, sure. And they credited me the 10 bucks right over the phone. We use a lot of printer ink, and we have a big, massive Canon uh, Pro uh, 10, uh, or the Pro 100 uh, printer. 
it weighs about 68 pounds. It's, it, it'll do 13 by 19 uh, photos, it's, and it'll do all the way down. We make um, thank you cards and, and calling cards with it, so it's very high uh, photo quality. But the one thing it does is it's uh, it's very um, how you say it, it's very ink thirsty, and uh, we buy our ink from B and H, and I order it, and they have a special deal. If you're a student or a um, an educator, or you work for a college and, uh, that has, well, pretty much you have to have your email address at .edu, which most colleges and higher education institutions do. Um, you're able to buy at a discount rate. And it just depends on what the product is. A lot of Sony products, for example, the camera that I'm shooting this on was covered under that um, student educator discount. But I bought a package of black CLI 42s, and I think what it comes with is it comes with a gray, a light gray, and two black instead of just the regular black, light gray, and gray. So you get a little more black with it because you use a lot more black. And then I got uh, the professional color package, which is cyan, magenta, yellow, um, what do they call it, the, 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 uh, the lighter version of uh, magenta and the lighter version of cyan. So it, that's what comes with this, and that's, that's our ink. This will last us, depending on what we print, um, won't last us very long, but it's a little harder to get in the Dallas-Fort Worth area. Um, without having to drive across town to get it and normally it's quicker just to buy it have it ordered on, on, on online with uh, B&H so that's our printer ink the next thing the next thing that I ordered uh, I've been doing some work on my portfolio and we use a, um, a, a Toya portfolio and this is an eight and a half by eleven it's it's fairly thick but one of the things that's nice about it it's it's a ring binder kind so you can buy the sleeves to put in and uh and that kind of stuff oh pardon me um so it, it comes with i don't know how many pages it's one two three four five six seven eight nine ten probably about 15 pages so i needed i needed more pages so I ordered a 10-pack of pages, and um, one of the nice things about it is I can take and uh, change out pages without having to change out all the photographs at one time. Hmm. So um, that, that, that helps out quite a bit, and I just take the whole book, and it's fairly thick enough that you can take and put a lot of pages. I think it's got like 25 pages in it now which puts in uh, 50 photographs in for a portfolio. And the last thing, the last thing that I bought was I, I bought a new, well, it's 12 years old, but I bought a new um, Nikon D800 and it was like new. It had 7,500 shots on it and I paid like $399.99 for it. And I, the one thing I don't like is I don't like to have ooh that's not good I don't like to have um, Nikon straps and I mean sometimes when you hang on a second there we go sometimes when you have um, this hanging around your neck people instantly know what you're shooting know what you have and it can be dangerous because uh, they know the value if they're professional thieves they'll know the value of what you what you have so um, I like to take the the original OEM manufacturer kind of uh, gear off of it and I put we use peak design straps for most of our heavy equipment and uh, this one I just got and it's their new peak design Slide light, um, I'm getting the whole words right. Slide light uh, camera strap, and it's their new color. It's called Coyote. Um, I like the strap, and the reason I got it in, in this Coyote is because Coyote is is new, and it's different. I figured I'd give it a try. I was going to order the ash color or the light gray one, 
And the reason I got it in this color is I have another camera I use at the same time that has the uh, Peak Design slide, the heavy the camera strap on it, and it's black. So in a quick glance, I want to be able to tell what camera I'm grabbing. And uh, so far, it's a, the only thing really major I can see on it that's really different. It's, it's a little lighter, and it, um, uh, it's a little shorter than the, um, the regular Peak Design slide. And I've carried it around a few days, and I like it. It's got these attachments that you can take and uh, push them in, and it, it unhooks. And it comes with four of them. And one of the advantages of it is if you have a real heavy type um, uh, lens, like I, my 80 to 200 is fairly heavy, I can put it on the base on the tripod mount of that and carry it so it doesn't put all the weight on the lens mount itself and then break that lens mount off. It also has these, um, they're nylon covered and steel, I guess they're steel wires that. Um, mount to the the mounts on the camera and that was my first thing is I go how long can those last well the last uh, the, the other strap that I've got is probably lasted two three years at least and they give you four of them when you buy one but the other nice thing is with this kind of setup it doesn't scratch up the corners of your camera it doesn't wear the camera out and in the old film days you put a guitar type strap on and it would wear the paint off the off the frame of the camera, so it, it made a big, big problem. So that is pretty much our little uh, junk camera haul that we do, and we do it probably three to every six months. It keeps us from having to order uh, all the time. And one of the nice things about it is we buy things on their credit card. They have a deal where it, you can either buy it with interest-free for so long, or you can buy stuff that is um, uh, no sales tax. They deduct the sales tax from it. And uh, their customer service is really good and really nice, and we love dealing with them. By the way, this video is not paid for. They have no idea it's even coming. Uh, we haven't talked to them about doing a video, but just we're going to mention them because this is who we normally deal with uh, when we buy uh, online. And uh, hey, if you found anything in this video that, that's worthwhile, of interest, uh, you like it, push that like button, do all that stuff. Um, we're growing still. And please uh, go ahead and, and subscribe. That helps us out a ton. And uh, we look forward to producing some more videos for you. And thank you. For, for watching, and we'll see you pretty soon. Thanks a lot. Bye.